what is up guys this is Kiwak here and welcome back to the Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon co-op let's play with my great friend Brandon. hola my great friend Brandon Pokestar last episode is up on his channel if you did miss that please make sure to click on his link down in the description and subscribe to him so you do not miss a single upload uploads do alternate I like to mention that at all of our episodes just because I even got a comment on like episode three <laughs> or was it three or five yeah I think you got it on three asking where two was I think I did get it on three and they said where's two but that's why we're going to keep reminding you guys, you got to subscribe to both channels if you do want to keep up with the entire Let's Play. But today, today everybody, we're just going to get right into it with this Alima battle. Because yep. last episode we ended right before the Alima battle. So, let's get it. Let's do it. That oh, was dialogue? so dramatic. <laughs> yeah. He, he just... <laughs> I liked it, just but it was a dramatic, dramatic person, yeah. Behold the magnificent Pokemon of the one and only Captain Olimia. I love how he addresses himself all the time. <laughs> Third person. Yeah. Third person. Ilma is just like the epitome of conceited in a way. Like, I don't know. Just the way he always is like the way they smile and everything and they just stand yeah. there so like look at me I am the best I am Captain Ilma like <laughs> it's funny yeah it's funny the funniest part about it is Ilma's like in battle stance oh I yeah I don't get it I don't get why Ilma's back there did they always do that when they use what? an attack did their Trainer animate too? Um I don't know if it did it every time. Holy em damage! <laughs> that em was one hit! Oh my lord. You just need that thing to a Even though and it's a heals. even though it's a level eleven Um and we're battling level tens, you Ooh. need that thing to evolve. It's a crit. I did I see mean the crit. I'm not I I've got plenty of potions. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Your cheap potions, but you got those quick balls, too, so it, it evens out. 12 quick balls is probably... That tackle does way too much damage. Does he have your... Did he leer you or something? I think he did. Oh, yeah, because your your Benary had the little... On the bottom screen, the little mark at a stat yeah. change, so he had to have leered you. Oh, that right. still does so much damage. All right. I need... That's wild. I need... I just realized that this Smeargle doesn't use Sketch because this isn't a randomizer. <laughs> I always expect oh, when I lol. see a Smeargle, an immediate Sketch. Because in a randomizer... Hey, the Quick Claw. They all have Sketch. Because that's just level up moveset. But... Yeah. In this, I think it has one of each of the main elemental types. Because it is yeah, leafaging it me right now. Yeah, mine will have Ember. I bet it has all of them, to be honest. I bet you just that Smeargle has Leafage, Ember, and Water Gun. I just have a oh, feeling. There's Ember. There's the Leafage. I sent him my flying type, though. We're good. We're chilling. We're chilling. We got this. Oh, I have Rock Smash now. I totally forgot. Totally forgot. That tackle did way too much. That tackle did way too much damage. Huh. The defense is dropped. How do I... How do I safely switch? Um, let me check. I don't want anybody to go down, because I want everybody to get this experience. Hey, the quick claw popped. What does your ability do? This Pokemon uses suction cups to stay in one spot to negate all moves and items that force switching out. Interesting. I didn't know Inke so had that. Uh, I forgot I outsped last time because of the quick claw. Oh. <laughs> Go, Calvin! Kill them! I could switch in to my Inke because it has a quick claw, but I just feel like... Let's check my defenses. Let me check my defenses on my Mons. Um, 
My Pompleo I has the how highest tanky defense. I, I think Inke would live if I switch it in. I know it's not a Nuzlocke, so it really doesn't matter. But I just yeah. want experience. I just want All that experience. It. And they're healing. All right. All right, dog. All right, dog. I just need the Quick Claw to pop, and Foul Play might take you out, though. Nope. Nope, but we should live. We lived on three. Just. Lived on three. Just take him out with Foul Play. Thank you. Thank you, Inke, Wild. for being the best Mon in the entire world and getting Foul Play at level nine. That doesn't make sense. If I ever get one of these in a randomizer, I'm I'm losing it. I'm going to be so happy. Spray. Everybody leveled up. Everybody leveled up. All right. I have emerged victorious. They gave us money. Big fast bucks. Stacks. Big and fast bucks. stacks though. <laughs> Sun and moon, they make it they make the money so easy, but at least the levels are getting harder. Yeah. You, I should say I uh, or should I say, you and your Pokemon make quite an interesting team. I hope you do complete my trial in Verdant Cavern and attempt my trial, the trial of Elimia. Oh, and you can get there from Route 2. The Rotonex of yours will show you the way. I bid you Alola. Alright. I need a Pokemon set up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need a Pokemon Don't go set back. Up. Wait, wait, wait. Brandon, right. Brandon wait. Um, go over here. And let's go ahead and try to get that totem sticker at the police station first. And there's one right there. Yeah. Because now that we've done all of that, we should be able to go around back to the Pokemon Center. While collecting oh. the stickers and whatnot on the way. Cause see, there's that one. There is that one. And then, because before it wouldn't let us go through that gate because it said wet paint. But I have a feeling now it'll let us that we've done the events. I think that was just a way of saying don't go this way. You're not supposed to. I love how we both just ran straight into that yeah. sign. <laughs> All right, and we can go this way and go to the Pokemon Center, and then I'm I going still back to the. Found dog. the Mime Junior. Watch, you're gonna find it right now. Nope. nope. I thought you were an encounter because I looked away. Bing, bing. I just feel like they have definitely made a lot of like collectibles, and I do like that because. Mm. I quite enjoy in games, even if it's just like items on the ground, and it's just like potions and pokeballs. It's just something yeah. to go run and grab. Like even if it's nothing, it's still somewhat exciting. Just like the the feeling of like, oh, what could this be? Let's get this. It's just like it gives the game more of an uh, exploration sense, I guess. Yeah. And I like that. But all right, so we could go up to where that trial is. But I'm going to go back first and see if we're missing anything over by the dock. I'm going to say, yeah, there is. And I want to get some Masalda. You want, oh, that's right. You got Malasada. Oh, Brody. Oh, and there's a TM oh. over here, too. XP level. It's been there since the original game, but there is a TM over here. Do not forget that when you're done with your Malasadas. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. I don't think I've seen a Grimer yet at all. Besides Joey's. Have I seen that? I have not. I have no, not seen a Lonely Meowth until right now. Meowth, that's right. Munch, munch. Yes, look at ya. Bonaris Just affection went look at ya. Nice. I don't know how nice. many likes she stacked. But I'm going to try another one. I wonder when we'll get a Soothe Bell, because that'll help you, too. It doesn't look hungry, so it gave me a refund. Oh. Oh. I can only it do only it once one. a day, probably. But hey, once a day is all it's going to take, because that thing should be evolved by... I don't even know. It depends on how much we bulk today. Breaking the fourth wall, but... But... Yeah. True. But it's funnily enough, even with a series getting uploaded as fast as this one has, the viewers will probably be surprised to know we haven't bulked at all because yeah. I fell asleep on the launch day when we were supposed to record. And I stayed asleep for five hours. <laughs> Woo. So now Brandon has woken up at 7 a.m. It is past midnight for me and we're doing this all over again. 
And it's still worth it because what? what can you do when when mistakes are made? I got the Abra. Nice, nice. I got this Meowth. Caught this Meowth. I'm still only 2% through the decks, but that's good. Makes me excited to know. I am, well, three. Just. I'm trying to think then, so... We should check how many each of us have caught, and I'm going to try to do the math. Of... How many mons are in. Unless the dex is already national, but I highly doubt that. Yeah. Because Rockruff... Or not Rockruff. Um, well, Rockruff is in the hundreds, but the starters are still, like, the first ones. Yeah, that's true. Echoed voice. I'm TM. ready to see. I am ready to see everything. Uh, you see the name I'm giving this Meowth? Giovanni. I can't do that. I can't do that, actually. I can't do that. This thing is an Alolan Meowth. Alright? It needs mm. an Alolan name. It cannot be Giovanni. Um. The Marina. Ooh, Totem Sticker. Alright. I don't know why this this is anything, but I'm naming it Geo Hula. <laughs> <laughs> Geo Hula. Was there a? T Did you get the TM? Yeah. Okay. Echoed voice. I actually have that on one of my mods, on my picky peck. I actually don't think that's a terrible TM to get either. That no, actually might help out your binary. You might want to look into that. Might want to look into that. It is. Unable. It, it is like it's like Fury Cutter, but better. The user attacks the target with an echoing voice. It is this move is used every turn. It is increased and it starts at 40, so that's actually pretty good. But of course, the one mon you'd want to learn it can't learn it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh well. There's two totem stickers down here. All right, I'll go grab those. I will go grab those. And I have a slight feeling. No, it can't go that way. Never mind. Never mind. Can you go this way at all? No, it's all blocked off. All blocked off. All right, can I go this way? No. I wonder if the marina will be right. useful in this game. If the what? The marina. If it'll actually let you go anywhere. Did it last time or no? Nope. <laughs> really? I feel like wherever it brings us, it's it's gonna be post game. Probably. I feel like they Probably. definitely last game had like intentions to go somewhere with it, but they yeah. were like, okay, look, we designed this and we had ideas, but we're scrapping the ideas and we're just gonna leave it as a regular building. Mm -hmm. Another one right here. All right, how many do we have? Eight totem stickers now. All yep. right. All righty then. Wait a minute. What is this? This looks like a bridge. I don't even know what is going on anymore. I feel like that's for the cruise ships. The cruise! Alright. The cruise. Um. What is this building? Alola Photo Club. Oh, yeah, no thanks. <laughs> we could do that later if we want to. Just to show it off, but that wasn't something that I yeah. was like... Oh my god, yay, they did it. Like, it was just like, oh, hey, more more new features that I might never touch, but I appreciate anyways. <laughs> what is this item? True, true. If you need a tiny mushroom, I know where to find one. <laughs> it's ever so tiny. It's hiding. It's hiding behind everything. What is this? <laughs> a oh. bold abra. Now I've found a fur fro. A bold abra. So you've already caught six mon, or six in your PC, two on your team, that is, or 12 in your PC, my bad. 14 total and you're 3% wow. in. Yeah. Right? That's good. Mm -hmm. That's actually kind of good. Because it if it was, is. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to do math right now in my head. If, if, just if, hold on. Um, I'm really trying to think. So in the original decks, it was 300 to be, was it 300 or 301 to be 100%? Um, 300. 
Cause I, cause I know they had 302, but you didn't need more shadow. So if it was 301, that would mean every three Pokemon would be 1%, and that we'd be at 3% at 9. But, you're at 14, and you're at 3%. So, that means that we have quite a bit more. And you're in dialogue while I'm catching a fur throw. No, it's fine. <laughs> I walked into it. And you are in dialogue. I mean, I think it might just be Lily, if you want to try to go through it, and then I could just sure. do it when I get there, because... Obviously, I don't want to catch you stuck. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait for me, Brody. It's little Lily. More cinematic. Oh, I'm glad to see a familiar face. I always get lost so quickly. I can't figure out the roads here. I can't even buy my own clothes. But you, you're moving on to your first trial. You're going to Verdant Cavern. I read something in an old book once. It said that the island challenges were once a journey made to prove yourself and gain the strength to battle against the guardian deities of Alola. Like Tapu Koko, the people in Eek Town said that Tapu Koko loves Pokemon battles, didn't they? If we could meet Tapu Koko once more, do you think we would find the answers as to why he saved you and Nebby that day? Nebby, stay in the back! <laughs> oh yes, please take these. They're called revives. Uh, if you use one on a Pokemon that has already fainted, it will recover and feel a little better. Sure. <laughs> Freebies. <laughs> Brody, good luck on your first trial. I hope it all goes well for you. And now she chills. Like, oh. The man of the hour is here. Alright, hold on. I'm, I'm, I'm catching up. Let me name this thing. Let me name this thing. I got a, I got a good name in mind. Whoa, what am I doing? What am I doing? There's quite a lot of encounters here that will be, well, new. Brandon, how much did you spoil yourself? No, I I meant like there's lots of areas. Oh, that's what you mean. That we could, we have potential. Yes. All right. I named that fur fro do to the do. Do the do. As in do like the, the mountain do thing. Yes, because yeah. I know you could do multiple hair do's. So you know what? Let's do the do. Do the do. Alright. Alright. Let me real quick. Real quick. Because I know you're waiting for me. Deposit this fur fro. Heal up. I don't think I've healed up since Ilima's battle, to be honest. Don't think Not I. Oh, I, I have two mods I gotta get put away. Two mods I gotta get put away. And I just hit um eight or three percent right now. And I have nine. 12. So if that is the case that I just hit 3% now, they have added 25% more Pokemon, which means the full dex is about 400. That's cool. That is my final... My I know there's at least one, inca one new encounter in every room. I bet you it's going to add up to like 100 mons or... Well, evolutions as well. It's going to add up to 100 yeah. mons, obviously, but yeah. I also am curious to know if, like, um, will, how would I word this, how would I word this, um, will all of the stuff that is sure to come later in the game, will that be national decks or a lowland decks? I'm sure you know what I mean. Yeah. I'm sure you know what I mean by that, because I'm not trying to spoil nothing, even though we've talked about it. I don't know if mm. I talked about it on, I don't know. I'm just not trying to spoil what happens way later on. That was in a whole bunch of trailers, but... <laughs> yeah. But, I'm sure people know what I'm talking about. And if they don't, they don't need to. But okay. True. I have caught up. Ah. There, Brody. Uh, once this honorary creature calmed down again, for now. Want to give it a try and pat him again? The only way will get used to you. Are they gonna give sure. us the option? Uh, yup. Poke it on the nose. I don't even know. I'm scared. Grab I'm... its forelegs or grab it by the horns. <laughs> they all sound dangerous. I'm grabbing it by the horns. Because I, I even said, you gotta grab the bull by the horns. It liked it. It's great. You gotta grab it by the horns. That's the right way. Really? Grab it by the horns. It's. I bet you it's because they were hoping you would know. 
the um, the saying, grab the bull by the horns. Yeah. Probably. Ah, maybe old Taurus can feel your love for Pokemon. He sure, he sure seems happy to know you. A jet. It seems like Tauros wants to stretch his legs and his own island challenge. Ha! Off he goes. What? You want to play tag now? <laughs> the Malemile Kuna never loses friend. I wish I was Hala. Hala is living <laughs> his best life. How he sad. is just out here chasing around Tauros like he is living the life. Wait, do you see that shaking grass? I do. This guy pointed it out to me. Did you talk? Oh, yep. Oh. We have to get back there. But I'm scared that we're going to run into something first. Drowsy. Is Drowsy new here? No. I didn't think so. Just Someone's had to check. been licking at his toes. Someone. Ekans. I don't think Ekans might be new, actually. Is it? It might be. I almost want to, like. I mean, you know what? I'm just going to look up everything that I want to know on Bulbapedia. Because I just need to, like, know. Someone's I... definitely got to this drowsy first. They've been licking his toes clean. <laughs> Are the males the one who have a different color toes or what? Oh, no. Or... They're... I'm so confused on like the drowsy thing. toes thing. It's like it's been dipped in chocolate. Oh. <laughs> now I get it. It's like it's been dipped in chocolate and somebody started at the toes. He's just... Drowsy's just a funny guy. Drowsy's just a funny guy. All right, I am gonna try to catch the seconds. I am gonna try to catch the seconds. I'm also going to look up if Ekans is new because if it is, I need to know we have nothing else, possibly nothing else to look forward to here being new. Yeah, I can't remember. I don't remember seeing Ekans here before. Let's well, I could be wrong. Is this updated yet? No, it is not. All righty. I'm gonna call it Doze. Well, in that case, we're just going to have to find it. All right. We are just okay. going to have to find it. Look at Ekans. Toes the drowsy. It's Pokédex is scary looking. Oh, wow. You know what? Ekans actually might be new. Because I don't remember ever seeing an Arbok in Sun and Moon. Hmm. I... Oh, there's mine. My rustling patch. <laughs> it was, was an, Ekans. an Ekans. It was an Ekans. So it has to be new if that was... Snake. Intimidate Ekans? That has to be hidden ability. That has to be hidden ability. I have no idea. Right? Why is music still playing on my phone? I've I don't it. even know what it normally has. Hold on. Shed I have to, skin? I'm finding out. I already have its Bulbapedia page open. If Bulbapedia Tuh. didn't just freeze on me. The Bulbapedia app is all sorts of buggy. All sorts of buggy. Let me name this thing. Let me see if it gets... Um, uh, nope. It is either Intimidate or Shed Skin. That's not Hidden Ability. It's a Hidden Ability is Unnerve. Alright. Um, I said still think Intimidate's better. <laughs> you know, I really don't know what to name this Ekans, so I'm naming it Luther. Luther. Mm. I just, it felt right. It felt right for an Ekans. Alright. Let's see what I get in the rustling patch. Oh, it came running. I forgot they do that. Yep. That's not Duh. new then, actually, because now I remember because it came running. It was an Ekans for me as well. Hold on. Ekans for me as well. Is it going to be Intimidate Ekans? It is. It is indeed. You should check its moveset, though, because I have a feeling... Are you going to catch it? Oh, you already did. I already caught it, yeah. You should check its poison. moveset. I have a feeling it might have something that's, like, actually... Actually quite decent if it was, like, the shaking patch and stuff. Quick Claw popped. I just want to evolve this Inke. I'm so ready to hold my DS upside down. So ready to hold <laughs> my DS upside down. I never knew that. And I know it's because yeah, I didn't wow. get into X and Y that much. But... Yeah. I'm just really surprised that I really never knew that. There's Abra's here as well. That's my first Abra. Michael Hita. That ha is that new? 
Yeah, uh, no. I remember Makuhia. Was he here, though? Yeah. I definitely, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna say, it seems like somewhat like a faint memory that isn't, like, super solid. Like, oh, he was for sure here, but... Yeah, I remember it definitely being here because they put it here because it's like helping you for the trial. Ooh, that's right. That's right. And that reminds me, there's another really cool mon coming up. Another really cool mon coming up. Or should be coming up right before the trial. I think you know what I'm talking about. Mm. The the young the young crab brawler himself. Mm -hmm. Alright, um, I don't want to Please don't say I just activated guts. I don't want to battle this person. But I have to. Are you in a wild battle right now? Yeah. Okay. Let's check out the levels of Beauty Crystal. The level with their cutie fly. I have a feeling it's going to be at least level 12. It's level 9. You have immediately proven me that you are no stronger than the wild Pokemon on this route. But you got Stun Spore. But you got Stun Spore. What type is Cutie Fly? Cutie Fly is Fairy Bug. That's what I was thinking. I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna find out. Because I like knowing these things. All right. If it was a Nuzlocke, I usually don't look up as much as I do. But we are playing through this game our first time. I want to know all of the typings that I should have known before. Oh, yeah. It is indeed Bug Fairy. And I don't think that changes when it evolves. It does not. It does not. That's a really cool typing, actually, though. If I do say so myself. Oh, definitely. I like seeing a bunch... Like, the typings that are uncommon are always cool to me. Yeah. Like, there's so many normal flying types. There's so many... Like, just like... There's so many reused typings over and over again throughout the game. Like... I don't- I, I like it when we have a Mon like Volcanion that's a fire water type, like, that's different. Yeah. That is original, that is super- nobody expects it because it's not going to make as much sense as it should, but that's what's cool, is when they have Pokemon that just have these crazy typings. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Is there a grass fire type? Um... I, no, I can think of. I, I don't think there is. See, that would be a cool typing. That would be... I'm, I'm finding out. I'm finding out while I catch this Makuhita. This is the episode of finding out. Alright? It's the one. Oh, man. Alright. Alice, can you learn a new type. move already? Yeah, you're, you're kind of... Alice, as much as I know you love Alice... I feel like Alice is going to be the late bloomer. I know it gets, like, Jump Kick or something at level 23. Does It's a happiness evolution, so all the movesets should be the same as Baneri yeah. and... Okay. It is. I made sure. And Wait, when it evolves, don't... it doesn't get fighting type except when it's it Mega Evolves. Right? I did ask for a new move. <laughs> oh, man. Baby Doll Eyes. Oh, man. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Lowers. Um, did you check the shop in Haoli City? Paul. Because I didn't either, but there's two people, so they might be selling TMs. I think it's, uh, X items. Who wants to learn Swagger? Who wants to learn? Squishy, you want to learn Swagger? No. No. It's not bad, but they might be selling TMs. I might have to go find out. Because... Why is it doing this? Keep old moves. Keep old moves. I just this feel like... This is where I wanted to come. Oh, the cemetery. That's where I was kind of looking for, too. If we don't get a ghost type there... If they didn't put Phantom or Ghastly there... I think Phantom was here. Ghastly? Ghastly. I just called it. That was might have been there, too, though, right? Ghastly. Yeah, was Ghastly it? was here as well. I think... 
Mm, I All think right. it was Gaslight Phantom Mistrevious. That sounds really familiar. And I, Drifloon. I think the reason I said, um... I think the reason I said Phantom was just, like, maybe in my head, once again, it was one of those things where I just thought it was there and it felt right. Yeah. It's either here All or right. it's later on. I remember it was in the game. It might actually be, now that you say later on, it might be on, like, the third island. After yeah. that little, it's like the town that looks almost like a, a strip mall. Yeah. How do I, is that a trainer? This is not a Can trainer. Can wake up? This is Alice not is sleeping on the job. <laughs> All right, Brandon, we have to decide which one of us is putting a, a Ghastly on their team. Do you want a Ghastly or no? I want to see what's here. Oh, that's right. There's more to look at. That's the thing. That's the thing about playing the new game is as much as I want to just put a bunch yeah. of stuff on my team, there's a TM here. As much as I want to put stuff on the team, it's like, do I really want to put stuff on the team just to replace it and then the training was for nothing? True. But Gengar, I definitely, I would definitely be happy with a Gengar on my squad. Ooh. Ooh. Pokemon not... facts for everyone. If you full sight ghost type, you can hit with an arm type move. Nice. Whoa, 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 Brandon. There it is. The drift loop. Yeah. It's not the new one. That I'm was there sure too? Was here. Yep. What the heck? Do you want that on your team? Not drift loop, no. <laughs> Brandon, <laughs> I'm just trying to get one. you some more mons, my dude. I know. Because I don't want to add a lot of mons to my side when you're not adding a lot nope. to yours. Because it's going to look funny, all right? It's going to look funny, all right? Oh, you got it. It's a male. I know. I knew what you were naming it. Has to be. I knew what you were naming it. It can't not be. The king of... Uh, or who I would like to see as the king of the PokeTuber community. Literally, mm -hmm. in the most literal sense. In the most literal sense. I'd have been happy with that if I was playing a Nuzlocke. What, Ghastly or Drifloon? Yeah, Ghastly. No, I would be very, very happy with that. Or Drifloon, honestly. Compared to Ooh, the other other mons that you could get in a Nuzlocke and whatnot. Neither yeah. one. Neither one of those are bad at all. Alright. You're filling up that Melly Melly Pokedex real nice. Uh. Uh. 10% there. 10% there. And that's without evolutions. Yeah. Right. Um, you're a female Drifloon. You're gonna be a Drift Blim. It's easier to do though once you've got the base evolution. It's easy to just evolve them then. To get the shiny cheer. Oh wow. Oh wow, that Hapini got bodied. What? That I Hapini got bodied. I haven't battled <laughs> any of the trainers here. She has a Hapini, one of them. And it just got bodied by Pound. And I'm learning Razor Leaf. Sure, that let's get rid of Taco. Is pretty good. That is pretty good. High chance to crit. Stab. Mm -hmm. right. Ooh, fake out. Uh, it's on the macro here. Well, well, TM100, confide. I think that lowers attack. Think that lowers attack. I have no idea. I can't remember. <laughs> All right. I'm not battling these trainers. As much as I would love to stay in chat. As much as I would love to stay in chat with you trainers. I got to look at what's in here. Zubat. Zubat. You know, a Crobat would not be bad. It wouldn't. Crobat would not be bad, but I already got my flying type for the moment. For the moment, I could always just change my mind later, but for now, I'm rocking with that piggy peg. Uh, there's my Drifloon. Nice, nice. Are you sure Drifloon was here? Yeah. Are you sure? All right. I'm taking your word for it. I really don't Pre understand how my phone literally keeps playing music. Like, it, it doesn't make sense. I think it's just SoundCloud being glitchy because that was the last thing I used. Ooh, Pro Marina wants to learn Aqua Jet. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 
Without a doubt, my dude, you can learn that. I'm gonna get rid of Growl. As much okay, as Gaslight, Drifloom, and Zubat are native. All right. So we have seen all of that. So anything yeah, different. So anything else is new. Sweet. Sweet. Yeah, there are no fire grass types. None. Just finished looking that up. <laughs> <laughs> Let me check if Ekans was originally there again, though, because I just realized a way I could have checked. A way I could have checked. And it's not. It's like literally the best way I could have checked. Um. Yeah, Ekans is new. Ekans is completely new to this game. Oh, yeah. Was not in the original decks, so we have already seen that new encounter. It's unfortunate that it was only in Ekans, but hey, what you gonna do? Beggars can't be choosers. Alright, we got a, a Zubat, female Zubat. I have no name for a female Zubat. No uh, name. Ooh. If it was male, I'd have had a name. I'm gonna name it Fanga. Fanga. Don't know why. Well, I do know why, kind of. It's just fangs. But Fanga. Don't want to add you to the party. Did not want to click that. Do, 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 do. I really, okay. What I think we're going to do right now, even though we really haven't gone, well, no, we battled a Lima this episode. We did stuff. I am going to see if we could find this encounter that we have not seen yet. And then we can end off my episode. Okay. And then we'll keep moving. Do, 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 do. If there is anything here, I'm hoping that there is a new encounter here. I really am, because so far we have not seen a single area without one. I don't believe there are any. You don't think so? Let's see. Yeah, well, I haven't I even caught a ghastly yet. I haven't even caught a ghastly yet. Um, are ghastlies annoying to catch? And uh, they're pretty easy, actually. All right, let me find a way. I'm gonna hit foul play. If this thing goes down from a foul play, then I'm not catching it. <laughs> I'll catch another one later. I will catch another one later. All right. All right. All right. Alice became confused. That was a lucky pound. We do 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 do. We living. How did you find out who was native here? Did you look it up? I looked up, yeah. The Sun and Moon. Okay. Okay, yeah. I don't know if there's going to be anything different here. But then again, keep in mind um, how many, how long it took you to find Baneri. Mm. So there is a possibility. I just want to see. I just want to see before we end off the episode. Because if there is something, this could be crazy. I'm assuming it will be a ghost type or something like that. We're in a cemetery. I don't think we're gonna find anything though. Not in the amount of time I would like to. Giving it one more encounter. And if it don't show up, then I'm giving up on finding it. Unlawful, that is a crazy name. I like that. <laughs> I like that. All right, give me an encounter I have not seen game. No, I don't think we're going to find anything right now. All right. Well, in that case, I think we are about ready to wrap up today's episode, if you are. Yeah. All righty. Okay. Oh, well, guys, I couldn't even run. I couldn't even run. Well, guys, that is going to do it for us today. We didn't get, like, the most in the world done, but we're enjoying our time through this game. We're taking our time, moving, seeing everything that we want to see. So it is going to be a little slower pace sometimes like this right now, but next episode, we will be making some progress. Maybe beginning the trial. I don't know yet what's going to go on with that, but oh, we will true. be moving forward and seeing more stuff. And, yeah, if you guys enjoyed today's video or... Today's videos, I guess, because that didn't make sense with how many we upload. Please make sure to hit that mm. like button down below. Really does help us out. We both appreciate it so, so much. And also make sure to subscribe to Brandon once again to not miss the next episode. But with that, guys, we're going to get out of here. My name is Kubowak. That is Pokestar. And we are signing out. Peace. Bye.